Good. Hey guys, my name is Tyrell Gill. Just wanted to get you uh, some more workouts here. I know a couple of weeks it looked like we had some people following and had some, some good results. So the two, we're doing two workouts this week. The, the first workout is 10 rounds of 10 lunges, five broad jumps, three handstand push-ups. You just cycle through these for 10 rounds. Do that for time so you get this done as quick as you can. Then we're gonna finish with a plank hold for 60 seconds. We're doing three plank holds and you just rest for 60 seconds in between each plank hold. So I'll demonstrate these movements real quick so we know what we're doing. For the uh, 10 lunges, we're gonna to wanna to step down, touch our back knee down lightly. We're gonna push off of our front heel and stand back up. So these lunges are gonna be lunges in place, touching the back knee. Now I wanna make sure I'm not pushing this front knee past 90 degrees. We don't wanna go over our toes, so we'll try to keep this over top of your heel. Okay, that's good for the lunges. Five broad jumps. The broad jumps, we're gonna jump as far as we can in one jump, and you can either turn around right after that or keep going if you have enough room. Then you could turn around, those are your broad jumps. Okay, uh, coming into handstand push-ups. We did a handstand earlier. If you don't have a handstand, you're probably not gonna have a handstand push-up yet. Okay, if you can't do a handstand push-up and you do have a handstand, you can try a handstand negative. Lower yourself as slowly as possible. and then kick down at the bottom. Okay, if we don't have those, let's just switch to regular push-ups, okay? Whatever modification we need for push-ups. Finishing with the plank hold, just like the other week, 60 seconds up in the top of the push-up position, holding this nice hollow body position here, okay? Workout number two. We have max reps in 12 minutes of six deck squat jumps eight mountain climbers per leg, and then six clean and press. You're gonna cycle through these as we get as many reps as you can in 12 minutes. We're gonna finish with a side bridge, 60 seconds, two side bridges, and rest 60 seconds in between, okay? So going into the deck squat jumps. Building off of our squats from the weeks prior, we're gonna do a good squat first all the way down, roll back, Hips come up, swing our feet back underneath us, jumping into a squat. So again. Okay, if you don't, if this is not working together, let's separate it. Do your squat first. Try to roll back. You're going to have to keep your background down here to be able to roll. You can use your hand if you need to. Coming up, do your squat jump. Okay? Eight mountain climbers per leg. Start at the top of the push-up position. Bringing your knee up to your elbow and switching legs. Eight per leg. Six, clean and press. On the clean and press, use any weight that you can find. I'm gonna use the kettlebell here. You can start with it down below. The idea is we're gonna go from the ground up to shoulders, pressing it overhead. So that would be one. So we're going to do six total. You can, if you're doing it one hand at a time, do uh, six total, so three per side. Or if you just have a dumbbell, you can grab onto it, do it all at once. Okay? If you guys have kids running around the house that want to work out with you, you also can grab a kid, pick them up off the ground, up to the shoulders, put them up overhead. Okay? That's the kid. And finish with the side bridge. Elbow below the shoulders, making sure we keep a nice straight line. You're in between two panes of glass here, holding this for 60 seconds. Rest for 60 seconds and repeat. So those are the workouts we have for this week. Uh, post your comments on uh, Facebook. That's Tyrell Gill, personal training at WindyCityCrossFit.com. Thanks.